Thomas Curtin became the second cross-country runner in tech history to win the ACC championship, taking down a field of 134 runners at the ACC 2015 cross-country championship in Tallahassee on Friday morning. The team hosts the Hokie Open on November 6th at 4.30. Women's tennis participated in the Terrier Invite this weekend at Wofford College. Marina Silva, Sloan Barton, Frances Payton, and freshman Emily Pence all picked up at least one win in either singles or doubles during the two-day tournament. The Hokies head to the USTA Collegiate Clay Courts November 5th through the 8th. The wrestling season officially kicks off on Saturday, a match against Iowa State. Women's soccer finished the 2015 ACC regular season in fifth place. However, this week could not get the win against 14th ranked Notre Dame on the road. The Hokies kept it close in the first half. It was tied at halftime, but gave up three late goals in the second to fall to the Fighting Irish. Men's soccer played their last two games of the season this week. The guys started off the week against Belmont here at home at a very rainy Thompson Field. Colin for Firth headed the first goal of the game into the net in the second half off of a free kick, but Belmont quickly struck back with two goals, beating the Hokies 2-1. On Friday, the Hokies traveled to Duke and dropped a hard-fought 2-1 contest on the road to conclude the 2015 season. Tech finishes the season 5-9-3. Volleyball had a tough weekend, first took on Miami on Friday and battled all the way to the fifth set against a very good Hurricanes team. The squads had five tied scores in that final set and four lead changes, but despite that, the Hokies came up short and Miami took the win 3-2. Lindsey Owens recorded her 1,000th career kill in that game. Next, took on Florida State on Sunday, the 15th ranked Seminoles. The Hokies put up a good fight back and forth action, but unfortunately fell 3-0. The ladies have two road games coming up, first against Notre Dame on November 6th, and then against Louisville on the 8th. Women's golf finished in 17th place at the Palmetto Intercollegiate last week to finish up the fall portion of the season. They're back at it in February. Men's golf heads to the Kiowa Classic November 1st through the 3rd. Swimming and diving hosted their first dual meets of the season this weekend in Christiansburg. The h 2 Okies swept the competition, taking down Queens University in Richmond on Friday and defeating Gardner Webb and UMBC on Saturday. The teams take on Notre Dame and Pittsburgh at the Christiansburg Aquatic Center November 6th and 7th. Thanks for clicking and tune in next week for another episode of The Rundown.